Spoken towards the hay cart. It's going to be a pop out of the apartment. How will it fare? NQZ on the balcony will fall first. And Dumao couldn't find anything. This A site pried apart. And uh, this is just a pistol. This, this is going to be a pistol round save from Zero Zero Nation. It's that dominant from Flamango. Read from Flamango. And the hunt is in a little bit. They're giving this feels tall to try to find some kills. But if you give these USP position, how much can Colt Zera do? An excellent molly in towards that mini pit position. He burned out in the open and he's gonna get finished off but nqz runs through the smoke gets a deagle kill and keeps zero zero in the round Nate, it's great oh no did, did nissim just disconnect what's what's going on on the balcony he was just standing still and do mao such an easy kill now showtime cleans up nqz but this could be a calamity for Flamengo, can Showtime bring it back? A second kill for Sneaky sure. A little pay, play out of the bracket side of things. Here's Cold Zero's rotation off and looks for his time to strike, clearing the angles. It's all a game of timing, Ooh. but Fasten, he lands the headshot there. That could open up some opportunities. They have to go B, though. That's the biggest problem. They cannot rotate, so Showtime makes his cross in towards the pool position. Pushing forward, Lotto spotted. Oh, but he hits the headshot on the Showtime anyways. A quick double from Lotto, and that is round ending. There's time to plan. Wait, he missed him. They're going to let him? Nope, they're not. And ZQK couldn't hit the shot. Right, now, Cold Zara tucked away in the corner. New position for him. And a flashbang off as well. Fasting was watching it, but it doesn't matter. Cold is going to win the fight, but spot the rest of the team in the meantime. There's still a setup here, though. You still see Lotto tucked away in towards his arch position. And oh, he hears the fallback. That's just only going to beckon him forward. Multiple players throwing utility. Easy kill for Lotto. Now onto the site. And QZ gets the hold. It's so easy for him. And it's just Delboni in the 1v4. Nothing to be said about that one. It's four in a row for... But again, it's only been the early rounds for Flamengo. We have yet to see a true defining round out of them. And it starts off on this, the same foot with Showtime going down. Now, NQZ. Yeah, his shoulders have been potted, but it doesn't matter. He just swings out and takes him down anyways. And now Taco. Oh, that's it's so free. It's so free. The bomb comes spilling through the arch smoke as well. Right into the lap of Cold Zera. Special delivery from Flamengo. Miss him. Trying to make something happen. Taco, even with utility in hand. It's still a struggle. Out of ammunition. Cold Zera is going to get the job done. And nothing going right here for Flamengo in this one. Two days ago. Inferno, big weakness in that arch side. Cold Zero uses the ability though, a nasty off angle. He's good for one, but then done. And so they could close in on this A side. Things actually do get weird. Yeah, they can wrap around. Library's now clear. They've wrapped the entirety of the site, and NQC's not ready for it. He completely discounted it, and now Nissim even comes out and deals with Taco. Big mistakes coming out from Zero Zero Nation, and that's going to cost them this round. Yeah, easy call to save right now. Lotto and Dumao going to call it. This is the best opportunity for Flamengo to attack this site. For the first time in this game, they're making some inroads here. What can Lotto do? A great counter flash that was delivered by NQZ, though. Saves the day. Now, Lotto will go down, but Dumao, the offering of Oak Forest. The new box is cleared by Nissim. What a shot. Now, NQZ, he's in coffins right now. And he's alone. He's being surrounded right now as well as players are inside of spawn. But Taco's going to help him out. Buy him some space. And QZ, though, couldn't hit that shot. Critical now. That could have been the avenue into the retake. But the nades go down. But they're not connecting onto the right players. Delboni and Nissim so low. Well, now it's only them. The bullets need to do the job, though, for 0-0. Zero, zero. Need to break apart this crossfire. And they can't break Delboni. Now just Taco. He has a smoke and a kit. How is he going to make it work? Miss him out towards Banana is going to swing before the team. Yeah, going to kick. That would be the economic break for 0, zero. seconds. Here we go. Another A execute. But this time, Taco is on the scene with the first kill. And they're all coming up lane. There's a massive setup. Taco almost good for another on the MP9. And there's no... Pre oh, but Del Pony, That's a massive kill. But the pre-fire through the smoke. Cold Zera drops the bomb. It's inside the smoke. Someone has to run and plant that. Now, eight seconds. Seven. Who's going to take out Cold Zera? Is he just going to stop the plant again? No. He's planting on the other side of the box. So Nissan will get it in. At least for Flamengo. But Cold Zera is still being a problem on the site. Now, ZQK out from Graveyard. Almost goes down, but steals the kill. He gets another. And no one 
I'm telling you, no one is looking at him right now. He gets the first. And Taco also found another towards middle. There are huge problems now for Flamengos. It's, it was supposed to be a parade through the streets. But now, it's calamity that could beset Flamengo as Taco. Almost another, but Delboni deals with him. Giving themselves chances, but it, there's fragmented right now for Flamengo. Delboni needs to win every fight he's given to keep them in the round. And with 25 seconds, they have to be line to be. But Lotto hears this rotation. Delboni getting flanked out, getting tagged up down to 24, and now 5. All Dumao needs to do is stop the plant, and or just stop the players. They've just won any. They're the ones needing to take these risks. And Dumao taking oh. a risk down Banana here. Playing oh, with no. fire, and Showtime's going to take care of him. Oh, he fell down off the logs. That was looking like a guaranteed kill, but Showtime stays snappy, but might not matter. They're still going to press gas on the A side of things. They run through the smoke right into the meat grinder of three defenders. And this is looking to be a halftime lead for 0, Zero Nation. It has to be a 16 HP 1v3 for Delvoni. Seems a bit far-fetched here. Best case scenario, he gets the numbers punched in on this B-bomb site and has a chance, but that's being covered now by Lotto. He has a smoke, though. Maybe he could toss that in. There it is. Look at that util set. Man, he's got everything down to pat. Like basically clear. Lotto. Trying for the spam, but of course one stray bullet will be the end of Delboni. So the plant is in. Flash on through. Yeah, he is a dead man walking. That is going to be eight rounds on the half. Big question here. And look at this. They're just diving down oh towards boy. the middle, trying to get activated as soon as possible. All right, Lotto up close towards the bottom. A great flash, though, to deal with oh. them and eviscerated our Flamengo on the spot. BPK will clean up one. Oh, make that a second. Bringing this one back. What started off as a calamity. DQK could make it a reality. Now make his way underneath porch. Anything more? No. Lotto on one point of health will collect his third of the round. And it puts Delboni in yet another 1v3. He was in that situation at the end of the last half. Now to begin this one. Towards T spawn. And as soon as that flash from Taco comes in, they all collapse. It's a really good read. And that, that brings up the question oh. of is this uh Rolling on in through the B site will be 0 0. Hoping for a fortunate kill, but. Not going their way. If Dumas were just lined up and triple <laughs> making oh my four, God. how did he get all four of them? I have no idea. Well, that's uh, $2,400. And so we're going to waltz back into the B site. Here comes the XU. Great flash on the showtime, but there's a boosted player up on new box. But he goes, Blotto just killed both B defenders. <laughs> a blazer beam. I, I don't know how. A lot of really crisp 2Ks going on towards that B site that he was finding. A couple of nice closers there as well. Look at this, dude. This, now, this is insane. Oh, so that? Two boys. Or not. A flash up high, Delphony. Completely blind up to Mountain. Somehow, Ooh. Showtime walks away with his life. He was burning at Sandbag. He was getting naded and spammed. But he walks away in one piece. And now, Taco, you're dead. Fasten up top on the boost. Why T sides can be so difficult. So one saved rifle round and great flash. flash. Get around like this, but there's a good flash. Nissim going to get overwhelmed and overrun by Cold Zarin and QZ's combination. If they can find the bomb site, get a bomb plant. That could be huge. ZQK very far removed from the situation, waiting out that smoke. So it's all on the back of Fasten oh, to hold no. this off. This is very risky as well. Fasten's alone in pit. No support from the site. Aw, oh, but lining up utility. Exposed by Arch. Cold Zara, nice headshot for sure. But with 30 seconds and 9 HP, bomb not in his control. Everything stacked against him right now. And he's even been spotted going up and towards that apartment's balcony. So really only looking for damage on the back end. Definitely a certain statement here from Flamengo, though. They are not to be messed with. Cole's there could get taken down after time. It looks like that's... What they're waiting for the pounce there. QK. Ooh, uh -oh. in. Oh, yeah, he got him. Nicely done. Surely there's a flash. Surely there's some sense of utility coming their way. And there is. There's a lot of utility coming their what? way. What? What a play. What a play. Right now, Dumao just runs through the spawn smoke again. 
What an execute here from Zero Zero. Get your strap books out here and get copying. Take some notes. It's only Delboni here on the site. Wait a minute. Not oh. everything's set in stone until it is. Now, ZQK did take down Lotto, but that's going to call in the save here from Flamengo. Th there's some beauty and art in that execute right there. Flamengo at all. I didn't have time to react, and I had X-Ray on. Thanks to me. Yeah, I mean, 100%. Fast and Anissim. This duo needs to put on the hold, and a bit of a wall smoke set up now for Zero Zero. They're crafting all these cool strategies, and it works Whoa. out wonderfully. It's only Del Boni sprinting through the moto smoke, but he receives a headshot for his effort. 14 now for Zero Zero Nation. He has a kit at the very least, but there's no utility. A couple of HP bars and mistakes oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. being made. To be honest with you, Lotto could encourage them into this. ZQK making some moves to smoke to isolate these last two. Yeah, players. they're strutting their stuff. No questions oh, asked. Boy. Here we go. Running up top banana. Showtime oh. out in the open. He's able to clean up the kill on Jumao, saving his teammate in Delboni. Man advantage working here for Flamengo. Great coverage right there. Counterflash could extend this advantage. Nice dodge from Lotto, keeping himself alive, keeping himself healthy. Nice taco. Works out the apartment side of things. They have an opportunity, but CQK still strikes before getting pushed back by Taco. Taco holding this angle. CQK tries to... Oh, holding that thread. There you go. He got on it first before Taco did. And so that's going to be a 2v5 working. That could get punished in rounds to come. You know, you want these rounds to be squeaky clean when you're in a deficit. Ends, ends, ends. Sorry. <laughs> but they're just going to drop a smoke in here. Try and keep him suppressed. While the rest of the players leap on into the site. Showtime blinded up. What an entry from Taco. But there's still two players in the pit they need to deal with. Fasting up on the balcony. He drops down right into Dumao. Nissim, last man in the site. Up above the smoke. Dumao takes the creative position to get 0-0. Closer to map point. And Flamengo, they really can't afford to lose this. If they go for it and falter, they're out of this map. But if they save, they have to win six in a row. The scoreline beckons them forward, but the economy wants them to save. They're going to press forward, and they're going to go down. 15 now for 0-0. Zero, zero. Stuff coming through. Like you said, they can't really afford to lose that round. And look at this. Nissim climbing out towards mid, making it so that at least they get a chance to bounce oh, back. Oh, no. <sighs> Tomao is using his opponent's smoke right now. This man is such a rat. He needs to get both kills, though. You need to convert them. Oh, no one can What's convert happening? them. How is this? How is he alive? How is anyone alive? Thankfully, order is restored. But now to the B site. Nissim has gotten some time to get into rotation. He's out towards the first orange's position, and he gets the double. Keeping him in this, but oh, and he's in a clutch position. This is his moment, his opportunity. As he gets that bomb planted and scopes up. Making his way towards the dark position. It's such an excellent position to clutch from. It's fast in. With that flash, it gets into position. First kill in for NQZ. And he gets the next. A clutch for NQZ to close it down. Map number one. That's a good uh, good case here. Seriously, the nation feeling confident and confident enough to rush him towards B. Oh, but confident in the face of the duelies? Well, maybe so. A trade is in, and Nissim can't escape. What a molly put in by that T side. Closing him down, but another duel Berettas brings out. Taco down, but NQZ still on that right side of Monsters. A very unexpected angle to clear the capacity. No, he's not going to consider oh. it at all. It's so nasty there from NQZ and Lotto. <laughs> Deals out one to ZQK. Just Del Boni revealed this position and now getting triangulated by these remaining three players of 0 0. He's going to have to hit some fast ones to make his way in and he can't beat NQZ. It's a pistol a round. Aggressive approach with that weapon. And in the meantime, there's a lot of damage already, but the dodge for the flashes and this some opening up proceedings is a great way to keep things off. Oh, and almost another, almost another, but it actually does show up. By the way, do Mount just hold up duelies to finish off Del Boni. But. The real problems are here on the B site. As the brawl goes down, NQZ snags one on the exit of that chance to plant. Not even going to attempt to spam the smoke, so 
a post plant gets to be established here for zero zero nation and now the favor is definitely with them but a great flash out of connector oh but do matt wasn't blinded but zqk still hit the shot now nqz around the pillar knows where his opponent in showtime is and he's made his cross on towards British. He knows where both of his opponents are. He swings around the site, but Showtime readjusts. Huge shot to be hitting there. Without the kit, ZQK will still get the defuse. And a forced buy comes out for Flamengo. He's going to pass that over to Cole. Where Taco trying to provide the cover for the plant. The Dennis Wills get pressed in. Is there anything more to back that up here for 0 0? A dink. So close into Fast Zine, down to four. But that might not be enough. Dumal. Is it planted in the open for him is the question. It kind of is. He does have an offer. Oh, oh no. Now that he hasn't found the first, but he does clean a fast scene. Still opportunities. Gets the next on his EQK. But the defuse is coming in from the side of Delbo. He gets off of it. He gets off of it. Now Dumal, an opportunity with the Tech 9 up above him. Delboni, though, does hit the shot. Dumal. Uh-oh. And... Ooh, QZ, I think he might have seen that, or maybe he gave him a little oh, bit of room. But well, he will I... find him eventually. He hunts him down. So maybe the prey goes right in. Oh, oh. no! Oh, oh no, Taco! Wow. Oh, down goes the totem pole. And Delboni, the only sort of reply, but this is. He's stuck, though. Ah, uh, he's, he's cooked, you would have to think. Versus Dumao? Yeah. Finished. Fast. Last. 1v4. Inside a short. Uh, he's getting. I think they know where he is. I think he's just been spotted. He is. Yeah, to lose rounds in that kind of fashion. Like, what about the rounds that you lose in a legitimate fashion when you get outplayed, not just in these simple little mistakes? You know, that's going to start to add up. Debellany, though, rolling out. That's a good kill there from Fast in the same. So, all right. On the eco. With some half bought up weapons. Making it do here for Flamengo. Yeah, these are some very scary rounds still. Whenever you have rounds like these where you have enough for a couple players to purchase and hero rifles, it's so difficult to close. So many teams struggle with this, and Zero Zero Nation, not immune to that fact, are going to have to plant in towards E. They've got three players flanking in, one player Nissim trying to draw time, and that's exactly what he's doing so very well. Will they expect this flank of three players? How could you? Yeah, how could you is the real question. Oh, but now they revealed. Oh, never mind. For short, fast scene up to. Oh no, gets ran down by Dumao. I, I don't know how he won that fight to save. Now Delboni, long bathroom spots two shadows, but the Cold Zera is there with the trade, maintaining that man advantage. And with 30 seconds remaining, they're looking to pounce on an A site that's fairly weak. It's only show time out towards long and. CQK is teammate in essence locked out. So if I make something happen though, no, it's the only the one. No headshot connected on the cold Zera. And no real opportunity for ZQK to deny the plant or get an act get an access point in this round. Smoke will fade. And NQZ oh. is just too prepared. Miss him down. And it's the exact and really starts to put the pressure on Del Boney and on this A site. Stuck between a rock and a hard place, he doesn't realize that the presence has fallen off, and they think he's flashed, but he's not blinded. He still lands a shot, and they all showtime head-to-head -head with Taco, but Taco's went out on facing the smoke, and rounds prior cannot happen once again. There's no trade potential here, but as Ooh. he goes down, this is going to trigger them in towards a, a hasty B-side aggression. Nissim is holding an off angle there, but no spot for him. The room's right no. past him. Dumal waits for the flash, and oh, things go from wow. bad to worse. That's a big mistake there from Zero Zero. I thought Lotto had spotted him there for sure, but so tunnel visioned on the monster play and expecting all that A presence to draw rotation. Oh, but is, is Lotto. He's gonna sneak by and catch them backs turned. Like, I can't believe it. Lotto's literally on his own here and he gets a double kill. Like, how? How does he get away with that? That setup is meant to counter him, but it doesn't matter. Oof. And now no Delboni way. just gets read into, and Nissim just caught standing, caught looking. I think there's going to be a technical pause after this one because it looks like Nissim might have just been disconnected yeah. yet again. Things go from bad to worse for Flamengo. Ah, 
Nice shot to land on the cold zero. Zero zero nation were able to muster a whopping one round on their T side of overpass. They have nine. But maybe not this one. But may maybe not ten just yet. Two kills in the opening exchange for Flamangos. The first time they've had some good news go their way. And Dumal's gonna fall next. Something yeah. to talk about here. Looking much better in the early exchange. Resources spent towards the B bomb site are what works really well on this occasion. Torch connector as well. Take that short control early on. I felt like they were sending those resources towards A a couple of rounds too many, and a bit of a change in scenery could do no harm. Showtime okay. grabs himself an AK as his reward for that kill in the cold, and NQZ a ticking time bomb in terms of dropping out this round. I mean, just a clutcher, but. Bit far fetched. There's one though. The problem is 30 seconds and the bomb is in his spawn. So. This is a saving effort. Or maybe not even that as ZQK. Stonewall them out of this round. I mean, this would be the statement. If 0 0 could beat this. Or maybe. Okay, that's the start, but Showtime holding behind this smoke. And he lands the dink. Tons of damage. Fasting next up. Lotto does come through with the trade, but now the flank starts to activate and Nissim, and yeah, I mean, one of these rounds, there's going to be enough players to get this across the line. Delboni, though, low on... Oh, what? Come on! <gasps> oh, no, we couldn't hit the shot! Ten seconds, just deny the plant. That's all they need. Wait, NQZ. He has time for the plant. Nissim, he didn't complete his flank. Oh, no. NQZ no. Did. So, Cole. We have a five versus five retake. I think this is like every play-by-play -play caster's dream. As you can see, as five players or four rather, begin to push into spawn. This is a conventional strategy that I've seen everyone do. It's very difficult to try and think how zero zero are gonna try and break this though. I'm being sarcastic, of course. This is a really odd situation to try and pick apart, but he's doing a decent enough job. It's zoom out with the kit as the last man standing though, and he's too far away from the bomb. Yeah, that's about how 5v5 retakes go. It's chaos for just a couple seconds, and it typically results in this. The T side get that oh, ball. I am not feeling great about this one. Time has really started to tick down low. If anything goes wrong on this execute, there could be problems, and that could materialize with NQZ. Oh a ton of tags, damage, nades. One. NQZ has hit the whole team with his scout. Now just do Mao needed to land two. It's so easy <laughs> for him. He can't escape, though. He's on 1HP. Oh, get the last. Whoa, uh, how, how, how has Dumao gotten to that position? He just, just ran through basically the entire team. He almost gets another kill. What, ZQK? Long run. Oh, he's going to win the fight versus the young guns. All right. That's a big two piece to turn it around. That was, Dumao just seems to be getting away with everything this game. Ooh, fasten. Timing is really rough for him. He's able to turn, though, and actually it's rough for Taco. Taco's the one walking away worse for wear. Taking a lot of damage in that fight. As the bomb transitions in towards A, it does seem as if Zero Zero Nation are making the exact same read with that transition that's been spotted. Oh, but look at this lovely, lovely reaction here. Great mid-rounding coming through from Flamango. They're going to dive back in down connector. This is what this position is so valuable for. Wait a minute, is those Zero rapid Zero rotations. Nation? They've also gotten back into position. All three players are here. Everyone is ready to join the party. Down on the site. Will it matter? Is the question. Cold Zero with the first. NQZ burns the next. I mean, NQZ is just running around the site. He's going to deny the plant. Now it's just Fasten. There's no time on this play. Seven seconds. Down in the pit. NQZ. He's just going to flee the scene. Oh, and Fasten no. just left grasping at straws here. He can't catch his target. And they'll lose the round by time. It was looking so good. Didn't see a boost assembled. But they are watching this. Miss him on the play. But the flash. It's so perfect. Fast Zane, blind it up. Listen, hasn't quite been spotted, so Dumao takes a step too far and will receive a headshot for his troubles. Big mistake there from Dumao to get that one back. But a nice capitalization from Nissim. Setting up his teammates with utility as well, trying to make their way through Monster, but it's a bit disjointed and it's giving over some alarm bells here to Zero Zero Nation. Yeah, it's not quite fast on the play. That'll 
Uh, maybe he's setting some hesitation in the side of zero zero. They haven't arrived with the full cavalry. Now, well, now everything's ringing. Taco up a top. Great flash up to the sky. Showtime blind. Miss him over the top of the site, though. That's his third on the round, despite being on such low HP. He gets that kill to secure them the site and perhaps a lifeline. Zero zero, not really. Are they gonna throw their hat in the ring for this? Lotto's gonna start creeping forward. Dropping it inside Del Boni, though. That's the fight that just wins the round. NQZ, do your best to save. Swinging around. Oh, a missed shot. Del Boni's gonna capitalize. No guns saved this here. Their zero. last purchase they got. If Flamengo take this, if they can get two in a row, maybe, but just the quick boost up Fasten. Not disciplined enough, and that's gonna hand the opener. Right to Taco and company. Now Nissim trying to make a hero play yet again and a successful taking down Taco. Next challenger in line. And Poldera making his way around the bridge, oh, but it's such God. a great off angle. You're never gonna be prepared for that. They'll start waltzing on through. Delboni starts to press forward as well. I think Poldera his position basically is known at this point, but doesn't matter. Delboni clears, but Coldzera hits his shot. A two versus four in the post plant. DKK scopes up. Misses this shot. Now both players have revealed their positions. How will Zero Zero deal with this? How will Flamengo defy the odds? It has to be showtime he's in able the able to deal with single time. It couldn't be worse, but he lands oh it in my time. Goodness. He recovers safely. And he's able to run away as well. That couldn't have been the worst. Like, that was the best timing for showtime ever. But he still could not win that fight. Feels like even when things go right for Flamengo, it just doesn't work out. Now NQZ even repositioning it towards the bathroom side. Oh. Is off too precise. Another kill onto Delboni. Repositioning. Oh, that barrel spotted. He's holding the god angle. Oh, is right he gonna now. go for it? Trying for the wall bang. He comes so close, but he'll get the third. Now just one more kill remaining on the ZQK, and they know exactly where he is. Pro League. On zero zero nation fingertips right now and do mal to deliver it 16 to 8 2 0 see ya in malta